The deadline to complete the proposed merger between Capital Land Mall Trust and Capital Land Commercial Trust has been extended from end of September to the end of November. Both real estate investment trusts will hold their unit holder meetings later this month to seek approval for the proposed deal. Due to COVID-19, unit holders will not be able to attend the meetings in person, but they may participate virtually through a live webcast or an audio stream. Questions can be submitted in advance. The merged entity, Capital Land Integrated Commercial Trust, is expected to become the largest REIT in Singapore and the third largest in Asia Pacific. It will consist of 24 properties with a combined property value of about $23 billion. Although the merger was proposed pre-COVID, the managers of the REITs say their proposal remains valid. Retail landscape has always been evolving, pre or post, ever evolution, ever changing evolution in the retail space. So let me just put forth this is actually not a new phenomenon that retail real estate is facing. Even pre-COVID, there's already a very visible trend moving in, uh, towards a, a mixed-use precinct or integrated development. So we'll, take, we'll, take, we'll try to seize that opportunity um, as it comes along. People have been talking about a more flexible demand for office space. I think what COVID-19 has done is actually not change uh, uh, this evolving trends. In fact, we believe that it has likely accelerated the trends. We are trying to create a platform that can address uncertainties that we are facing today. You know, the COVID-19 situation is fluid. We don't know when this, the situation will totally subside, but we're certainly making sure that we have a platform that's ready uh, to address the uncertainties and also capitalize on opportunities that may present themselves uh, in the future.